our next tips of crate training or crate games is going to be adding a distraction that they have to recall past. So far, all of our distractions have been involved with them maintaining their sit. Sit while the door opens, sit while they get leashed, sit while a food bowl is presented out in front of them. Now, instead of just maintaining their sit, we want them to not only find their sit while there is a distraction, but also recall to us past that distraction. Your distraction can be anything. Today it's going to be a food bowl, but if your dog is more toy motivated, it can be their favorite toy, their favorite food, um, it can be some steak, it can be another household pet. Whatever distraction you need to work with, maybe start with food, build to more exciting distractions, whatever the case may be. I'm going to set my bowl. The bowl is going to be offset. It is empty for now. It is offset, so me and Nova are facing each other. The bowl, or our, our distraction, is offset. I'm going to put a couple of cookies in my pocket just so I'm ready to go. Yeah, then we're going to take a moment and reward all of our dogs holding their climb or being in their kennel. Good babies. Good babies. All right. We are going to start with our bowl empty, Nova's in her sit. I want her to maintain that sit while the door opens. Yes, we can yes, and reward. I'm gonna reward Hyde so she stays in that sit. I'm gonna recall her to me. Cha cha! Yes, good girl. We always touch them, grab that collar. Yes, good girl. We're gonna feed from the pocket. What a good girl. We still have our dog. I'm gonna take a cookie. Oof, should have put a treat pouch on. And we're gonna put it in the bowl. Get it. Very nice. We don't want them to be tuning that bowl out so much that they forget it that it's there. If they forget that it's there, then it's no longer a distraction. And our whole goal here is to recall past the distraction. We want them to stages one through three, dive into their kennel like normal. She can have her cookie. That was kind of a big cookie. Gonna reward this dog here. Just wait for them to SIT. Good. Open that door. We can reward that sit. I'm going to reward high to keep her in her sit. Recall past that empty bowl one more time. Cha cha! Yes! Make sure they come all the way to you. We want them to, to make contact. We want to be able to touch them. Yes, good girl. And then we can send them to their bowl. Get it. Lovely job. Once she's back into her kennel, we can reward these other dogs when they're fine. Yes. Treat for going in the kennel. Reward our dogs who are on their climbs. Because they're good dogs too. Because they're good dogs too. Some of these cookies are awfully big. Oh, can't break it. Here you go. Nicely done. All right, now we're going to actually put a distraction or a treat in this bowl. We want her to see us do it. Oh my goodness, there's something tasty in there. We're putting our treats in our pocket. Empty hands call our dogs to come. We don't want to be baiting them with food. We always have to have a sit before we open the door. Good. Oh, 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 oh. Door always closes. Don't just use your body, but actually close the door when they stand or when they try to come out without permission. And just wait. Find your patience. I wish I could break some of these cookies. I can't, that's okay. We're just waiting for an SIT. Good. Door opens. I can reach in. I can give her a treat. That was a big cookie. You climb. There's treats in that bowl. We're going to call her to us. Cha cha! And she got stuck because she got in trouble with that closed door. So I'm going to move in closer. Cha cha! Oh my goodness. There she is. Oh, she's debating whether she wants me or that bowl of cookies. I can get low. Try to encourage her. I can once again, I can move in. Cha cha! Oh my goodness. So she got a little stuck here. That's it. I'm gonna reach in. I'm gonna take her. I'm gonna let her know she can come out. Come on. Cha cha! Cha cha! Oh! She got one. 
We're going to swoop them back in. So if they run to that distraction, that is their first choice. You are not their first choice. You want to try to catch them before they get to the distraction. She did get one. <laughs> you want to try to catch them and swoop them back into their kennel. At this moment, the kennel is a punishment. A punishment meaning to decrease the behavior. We're just, ooh, this naughty one right here. Sit. Thank you. <laughs> We just want to use this, this point as a reset, a reset for the behavior. So we're going to see if she needs to sit again. They're still cooking. She may not have wanted to come because she knew she wasn't going to choose me. Sit. Good. We can reward this sit. Reward that dog to be on her climb. No, but chat chat. And she still knows that she's not going to choose me first. <laughs> no, bees. Yes, good girl. Just changing that angle helped her be successful. So sometimes you got to get creative. We're going to give her a cookie. Go see. Send her permission to go see that distraction. Good girl. Oh my goodness, these dogs over here are being so good. So good. And one for Will in the kennel. And now you can have one. Oh my goodness, let's see if we can get one successful rescue on Cookie. It's in her bowl. She knows it's there. She has to SIT, very good for that door to open. Lovely girl. Lovely girl, she gets a cookie. Oh, she stands, that door closes. This one's gonna get a cookie because she's working really hard. It's hard for, for huskies. <laughs> it's lost on her bed over there, I can see it. <sighs> Breathe, find your patience, good. Really nice, we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna treat that sit, very nice. We're gonna try to call her to come. No cha cha. I'm gonna try a different angle. No ma. Cha cha. A little closer. Yeah. That's it. Yes, good girl. Yes, good girl. What a lovely job. Pet your dogs. Love your dogs. Then treat them from your pocket. She says, "I'm a hardworking cha cha. I'm a hardworking cha. I gotta get my cookie out of my pocket now. Really good job." And then you can send them to get that distraction. Get it. Lovely job. So you're gonna do this until your dog is consistent to running straight to you, tuning out whatever the distraction is. Clearly, PB Nana's is a big distraction for Miss Nova Chow Chow. Change your angles, call them, and they call them further away, rather than closer to the distraction. Whatever it takes for them to be successful to choose you first over the distraction. Have fun with your dogs.